three kids, Evie, Asa, and Dawson. The learning curve must be steep, but moms and dads eventually master the art of not losing their children. <laughs> yeah, we have to hold up like one, how many kids do we have eyes on, one, two, or three? And we got three, so we're good. Abby Ward and her husband Mike roll with the parenting punches. Guess who's getting baths tonight? Even the one that hasn't hit in generations. But yeah, they have a COVID testing right, right down there, the tents down, down there. Yeah. Colorado is loosening COVID-19 restrictions, and people who are vaccinated can ditch their masks. So yeah, it just seems still a little unclear. But Abby worries about her kids too young to get the shot. I think we're both really weary of what's going to happen now that it seems like the floodgates have just opened. You know, it's not just the parents that are feeling this way. The physicians and healthcare providers are also concerned because our children under 12 are the vulnerable population now. Nine health expert Dr. Pyle Coley is concerned about physical and mental effects on kids. It's really going to confuse kids and send a lot of mixed messaging when their parents can take that mask off. But the kids under 12 have to still put the mask on. They still have to be careful about washing their hands. And, and it's going to be hard for parents without modeling that behavior. Don't throw sand at each other, OK? Abby knows some behavior is out of her control. And it's raining Like who decides to get vaccinated. It makes you wonder if people are being responsible and doing the right thing. Please, you go first. Just one more thing to keep track of. On top of three kids. All right, let's boogie. Noel Brennan, 9 News. Go, baby D, go, baby D, go.